So we finished the flat racing for the week with a one mile two furlong 0 to 72 year old handicap here at Flamingo Park. Number one, Quickening Queen, Darren Howes, the 94 favourite, two murder elite, Stu Gray, three, Prosperine for Martin Needham, four, Talent for Darren Howes, five, Spirit Dance for Obi Wan, Lady Valsura Murkiel, six and seven for Alex Cherry, and number eight is Horsell for James Follis. Just eight of them to go over the ten furlongs here at Flamingo Park on dirt track two. So whatever dirt track one is, I wouldn't know. They had a fairly even break, and we're going to be led into the first turn. We have down chaps. This looks like Spirit Dancer and Lady Valsura are going to lead us by a couple of lengths to Quickening Queen the Great, and then a couple back to Prosperine Horsell, Talent Murder Elite, and Muir Hill. And with a mile still to travel, plenty of racing to happen. So up front, still Spirit Dancer and Lady Valsura. Maybe one looking to pick up a Flamingo Cup along with his Grade 3 one this afternoon. Well done. Going to be uh, waving the banners of America there. And the flag, stars and stripes. Do, 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 do. But it's still Spirit Dancer and Lady Valsur that lead this one by about three to four lengths to Quickening Queen, then a couple back to Prosperine and Talent. Out wide is Horsell, Murder Elite covered up, and Muir Hill. Five furlongs left to travel. It's Lady Valsur, Spirit Dancer. These have been the one and two, most of the race about three lengths back to Quickening Queen. Prosperine looks promising. Prosperine, promising, Prosperine. And then a couple further back to Horsell, Talent, Murder Elite against the fence, and Muir Hill. Again, and Alex Jerry Horse has got a lot to do from there. So in Inside the three and a half, and it's Spirit Dancer that's gone off in the lead now. But he's been chased down by Quickening Queen and Prosperine as poor old Lady Valsur starts to go backwards. So inside the two and a half now, Spirit Dancer still leads and heads for home. The whip's out. He's got a two length advantage from Quickening Queen. Prosperine's starting to go backwards. Murder Elite looks like to try and make a challenge, and it's Quickening Queen that challenges the leader. Inside the furlong and a half, Quickening Queen gets half a length advantage from Spirit Dancer. They're about four back to Prosperine and Talon, but it's Quickening. Queen that takes a length advantage now as they hit the furlong pole. Quickening Queen from Spirit Dancer, Talent, Murder Elite all trying to run on inside the half and it's Quickening Queen from Spirit Dancer, Talent on the outside. Could it be a one Darren Howes one two here and it's certainly going to be and it's Talent or Quickening Queen either one it doesn't matter the wind's in the bag for Darren Howes with a one two for the last race of the week the Flamingo Cup goes to Darren Howes wins it with the big great I think he was the favourite Quickening Queen. He was 9-4. to four, Justified that. Murder Elite got up for third. Well done. So Quickening Queen for Darren Howes along with Talent take the 1-2. Three at third was Murder Elite for Stu Gray running on well. Fourth was Spirit Dance for Obi-Wan. And fifth was Muir Hill for Alex Cherry.